mentioned, Litchfield County expected to get slammed with a lot of wet and heavy snow tomorrow. Yes, and with that, there could be several issues here, including broken snow blowers and plows. Meteorologist Lauren Richardson is live. She is at Goff's Equipment Service in Litchfield and has more for us. Hi there, Lauren. Yeah, hi, our Iron and Mark. And yeah, we are here. Obviously, we're talking about this being the jackpot spot for those snow totals, but there is still time to get a snow blower because you definitely don't want to be stuck shoveling that wet, heavy snow. It's the calm before the storm, but with spring right around the corner. Unfortunately, we switched the showroom over last week to lawn and garden equipment, selling lawn mowers, and then all of a sudden we're going to get a big snowstorm. So the guys had to go down to the warehouse, pull all the snow blowers out of the warehouse. But with winter still rearing its head, Litchfield County is the jackpot for wet, heavy snow. Yeah, you definitely don't want to be shoveling in this kind of snow. Uh, but yeah, even in the heavy, wet snow, the equipment that we do sell, uh, you're going to break shear pins, you're going to bend parts on your plows. Uh, you do have to be real careful pushing this real heavy, wet stuff around. Plus, there's a risk for power outages. With this kind of uh, snowstorm that we're getting, uh, supposedly high winds and, and that sort of thing, uh, generators are a big seller for us right now, too. If you lose power, uh, you're going to want some sort of generator backup, and uh, we have we have those here as well and are fixing those right now. Just remember to not push it and stay safe. Having a plow come or asking for help is always a good idea. If you have back issues already uh, on top of heart related issues, yeah, it could definitely, you know, be a problem for somebody who's not used to, especially this year with the lack of snow that we've had, not used to having to go out and physically move some of this real heavy wet stuff. Yeah, that's so true. And Tim also mentioned it's a good idea to actually start up your snowblower this evening just to make it sure it works. The fuel actually might be bad. So that's definitely something to do to prepare for the storm. Of course, keep with us here on Channel 3. And also download that WFSB weather app live in Litchfield. I'm Lauren Richardson, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.